What's happening, people? All right? Lovely Saturday morning, the day. Great weather once again. Um, just checking in, just seeing how everybody's doing. Um, hopefully, we'll be all back to normal soon. All these restrictions. I do. I, I do. To my opinion is. With the COVID situation, I don't think anything will ever get back to like how it was here two, three years ago. You know, where we just everything was we took everything for granted. You know, I think we'll always be wearing masks. I think there'll always be a social distancing. I just don't think it'll change me. That's my opinion. Like I think the world we used to live in two or three years ago, I think that's gone now, and I think this is it for now. Like I think anyway for well at least for a good few years anyway. You know, that's my opinion. Anyway, um, well, what about, uh, I've heard some interesting news about uh, YouTube's favourite son, Darren All Talk G, once again. I don't know how true it is, but apparently he's up at court uh, for carrying a um, knife. Apparently, I got told in a message, uh, like I said, I don't know how true it is, so don't quote us on it, but... Apparently he um, he forgot he had it in his pocket, a garden blade, and uh, he's up at court for it. So, phew, Darren, man, fucking hell. You know, you're waving knives about in videos, threatening people. Now you're being caught with knives in your fucking pocket. Claiming that, I mean, it's always tricking the book that off. Oh, I forgot it was in my pocket, you know what I mean? At the end of the day, you, you know, you kind of just forget there's a knife in your pocket, mate. You know, it's, it, just, it's, it just doesn't graph like that, you know? But uh, it doesn't really go well for the slogan, like, does it? Choose a life, not a knife. Uh, Darren, mate, I feel for you, like, because you've just went drastically downhill, you know? And, uh, you, you know, that, that passionate message that you had. It just seems to have withered away into fuck all now, like, basically, you know. Um, I mean, you know, I don't know what's going to happen to court, but fucking, you know, fucking, when you get caught with offensive weapons, uh, when you get caught with offensive weapons, anything would happen, mate. Especially with you just been, you know, you know, you've just done 18, yeah. You know, they could, you could hire you, they could hire you straight back in jail. I mean, I didn't wish that on anyone. You know, I don't wish that on, uh, well, obviously, you know, nonces and fucking beasts and fucking, you know, in fact, you know, death, fucking, they should be fucking castrated and fucking, oh, didn't even get us started on them fuckers anyway. But what I'm saying is, you know, you know what I'm saying. I didn't, you know, I, I didn't wish jail on, on, on people unnecessarily, you know. But um, when they just need a chance. But I don't know the circumstances, but it doesn't look too good, you know. Being caught with a blade in your pocket. And then uh, you've got this slogan trying to help the youth, uh, you know, by not carrying knives. And then I suppose a mentor is carrying a knife. You know, and then we've got you, like I said, waving them about in videos, threatening other people. At least two or three or four other people. Well, you know, Darren, mate, just, you know, I think you need to fucking have a rethink, me, like, and uh, get your head in order, mate, you know what I'm saying? Anyway, I'm off to watch the Formula One, right? So I will see you later, guys, right? In a bit.